Hey guys, greetings. How are you doing? I hope you are doing well. Good to see you. Welcome to Binal TV. If you are new to this channel and if you are, please consider subscribing. Thank you very much indeed for stopping by. Thank you very much indeed for clicking. I want to show you what we got here. We got HP MV 6020. Okay, this is 6000 series. Okay, this printer is multifunctional, multitask if you like, or triple in one. You can copy, scan, and print from this gear. Okay, this printer is using 305 ink cartridges, black and color. Okay, this printer you can save up to 70% on ink and never run out of ink by registering on HP ink okay hp ink service.com okay they will deliver the ink at your home address okay this is all location family printing you can copy scan and print from this printer this printer right now is connected to wi-fi network this blue light is steady on it shows you that it's connected to wi-fi but if it's flashing it signifies that it's not yet connected to wi-fi network okay right now this information here is information light okay if this is flashing it will tell you if you want to connect this printer to wi-fi so it will tell you to press it okay if you check how we connected this printer to wi-fi network information light you, you press it to cancel is to cancel after that underneath is also for you to load is paper to copy black and color okay what we are going to do I want to show you this is the scanner for this printer you stick your document on top of the scanner and it will do the job you can see the light is on this is to copy this light is to copy color and the other one is to copy black okay and also here is the ink cartridges okay this is where the ink cartridges are and check my video how we loaded these ink cartridges if you have any paper jam Remember to check at the back here, okay, and take this cover out and look, okay, all the way. Check for debris or any particle, any unwanted particle, okay. And once you finish, to open it up, press the spring together and and open it. And once you finish, you press it down as well. As you check here, if you can't find anything, also make sure remember to go at the back here, okay, and open this paper tray. And look over here look at the bottom here and to see if there's any paper jam what we want to do right now is to load the paper tray for this printer and print out alignment page make sure you print out alignment page the benefit of it is it will help your printer to function properly and smoothly it will make the scan okay and the job or copying from this printer very nice okay can print out a stunning photo from here okay what we want to do is to load the paper tray. to load the paper tray we need to print out this paper tray out okay you can load various size a4 8 by 5 4 by 6 for photo okay so i'm going to get the a4 paper So I have A4 paper here. Make sure you don't overload it. Okay, so what you do is push this across. Okay, you go in. Okay, it's in. Okay. This is how to load the paper tray. Once you've done that, don't overload it otherwise it will make this printer okay to print in segment also it can actually cause a paper jam okay so make sure you don't overload this paper tray once you finish push it in straight in okay this is how to load the paper tray okay It's right now picking, okay, recognizing that the paper tray is loaded, okay. To print out 
alignment page or complete alignment head for this printer what we need to do we go back to our mobile device okay going back to your mobile device go to back to hp smart app you can see from the app there is a lot warning here telling you that alignment recommended okay so click on the printer once you click you see alignment recommended you can see it's telling us alignment recommended so you need you must complete alignment unless the that printer does it automatically some printer will do complete alignment completely by telling you it's cal calibrating so once that is done you can print but this in this case hp mv 2 is asking us alignment recommended so you click on that alignment recommended okay then it should take you to this tool okay where you need to go where you need to go is you go back go to tools once you are in two section you see print report or print quality tools so click print quality tools once you print quality tools okay it will take you continue to print continue on your printer setting click okay right now i can tell you your connection is not private advance click advance it will tell you back to safety no you carry on click advance okay and click proceed okay right now where it's taking us is run maintenance tool to improve the printer quality of your printout okay so you see diagnostic report optimize and improve alignment align print heads okay so you click align print head okay right now this is, is aligning the print head for this printer It's processing. It will take several minutes. tell you alignment required for best print quality okay this is the essence of this okay once you finish you follow the instruction we need to place it on the scanner and press okay then it will scan okay and will tell you if it's successful or not okay so right now this job is done okay you see but you need to wait on your mobile device for it to tell you okay that is finished okay okay what is telling us now is place alignment on the scanner so we take it and place it on the scanner okay and the next thing you need to do is press ok on your mobile device it's processing right now so you don't need to do anything just wait and once it's finished it will tell you whether it's successful or not if it's successful you will see a blue a green good mark okay and we tell you to discard the alignment paper once you is completed here we go you can see you can see the thick green good, good mark you can see good okay you can see the mark okay alignment successful recycle or discard alignment page okay so click okay okay so this job is done right now okay so we discard this thank you very much guys this is how to load the paper tray and print out the alignment or complete and print out the alignment page so that you can use this printer if you're happy with this tutorial please do consider to subscribe it helps us to grow Thank you very much. I appreciate your time. Thank you.